good patio tanks. I got these rocks right here. I'm gonna get more rocks and I'm gonna do something crazy. Still got a little poop, but it's okay. This one could go anywhere. And I'm gonna try to stack this. Try to see if I can stack this. Let's see how this goes. guys are eating my hand. I've been feeding them off my hand. Eventually, I will make a comb over like this onto here. I'm gonna need more rocks. I got these from a nephew. These guys are so friendly. That's some I'm up to my hand. Look at this dude, he let me, oh. That's it for now, I'm gonna find more rocks though. Hopefully it gets them more space, hiding space. Let's close this. And if you guys haven't already noticed, I I got some pair, well I got a pair, I got two more. I got a pair, um, I'm making this into a parrot tank. Um, but eventually, when these flower horn grow up, they're gonna get paired, I'm gonna put them with these parrots and uh they're gonna be grooming them but as of now i kind of want this to turn into a parrot mix vieja or uh just any cichlid i was thinking about putting severums in here too but uh severums get quite pretty big and plecos as well i was gonna put pleco in here to eat all the algae up so i didn't have to clean but i might clean it because plecos Plecos I wanted were 10 plus inches and they were pretty big. Everybody 455. Same with the parrots. They'll get these parrots would get pretty big too. And since moving this lottery fish in here, he got super sick. Well, he was kind of sick in this tank already, but I'm moving into here and he was super stressed. He had white poop that are really hard. So I don't know. I'm just gonna uh, fast him and then I'll feed him some blood worms but everyone is doing super good especially that guy if you guys follow me on Instagram he's looking fabulous um, I just made a TikTok patio tanks TikTok if you guys want some tips follow me on there uh, if you guys I might start only fans for flower horns too let me know what you guys think about only fans for flower horn and they'll be cheap but this guy is getting a lot better. He's looking a lot better as well too. Um, he acts like that. But when there's a parrot in there, he's super nice. I mean, all flower horns are like that, but he, he looks super nice. This guy is blowing up really good. And as for this guy, I put him in a lighter tank. And he, his color is coming in really nice. I know you can't really tell on here, but gosh dang it. I wish the camera could pick up this color. He's a lot brighter than usual. Uh, he's, he's more of a yellowish, goldish with the thick black flower horn line. There we go. I don't know if that picked up, but just a quick update. That's what I'll be doing more like a, um, cichlid tank for these goldfish yeah i think that'll be a, i think i'll be the first one or the that'll be the first tank for these uh goldfish a cichlid tank 
I think it'll be pretty cool. I need to get some dragon stones too. I wasn't thinking about going big with these whole fish, but uh, this actually looks really nice. A display tank for for hair. I didn't want to do a foul horn because uh, I think flower horn as a display around the area will look nice but as right here in person right here i mean i've gone you've gone to some houses where there's people who put goldfish in their tank uh like in their living room or in their dining table or just somewhere where they could associate or mess around with the goldfish where it's more appealing than having a flower horn right next to you it's nice too. These flower horns look really nice. I feel like flower horns look better as a galleria and parrots. Same with cichlids. But as for goldfish, they're more like little chihuahuas sitting on your lap. These are the big dogs. These are the small dogs. Lap dogs. Alright, just a quick short video like that. Hope you guys like it. Um, yeah, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. I lied. I'm not going to end the video yet. I switched these tanks. These guys, it's been a couple days. I was going to upload the video, but I was like, you know, why not? I ordered this light right here and it came through. So if I'm having dinner outside or doing anything crazy outside, fun outside, just drinking, chilling outside with the friends. I have this and it's pretty cool because without this, it's it was kind of dark but adding this light in here <clears throat> let me show you guys so i decided to screw screw this on but i taped this all around well i didn't tape but it has double-sided tape on there already put this under there i have my outlet right here it came through there it's just really quick diy stuff right here <clears throat> Let me know what you guys think. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I'm still going to add some more rocks in there. But as, as far as uh, this thing goes, it's really, really good. I need to clean all the algaes. I forgot to show you guys. I have a remote right here. Go off. Go on. There is the 3,000. Four, five. There's a 6,000. And then there is the modes, different modes. Whoa, that's gonna kill the fish. Yep, only those two modes. I could darken it. Yeah, see, and I could brighten it up. Same with the other two. This is the daylight mode sunset mode and here is the boom night mode but I'm gonna keep this 6,000 right here I like that and if you guys don't see any fish over here that's because I took the fern out this guy is still recovering I took the fern out he's in here he's loving his tank <clears throat> this guy and the parrot is doing good uh, I'm lucky that he didn't kill the parrot because this dude is super aggressive. And this guy over here. Oh, here we go. I got the light on and this is his true color. He's a little bit more red than this and more gold. But he looks fabulous. Just wait until he grows up. He's not there yet. But this is going to be a giant. This dude is going to be a giant. And as for over here, King just doing King thing. Grooming. Don't worry, he he don't he can't hurt them. They're just super shy, super scared. But Kane, he's been he did it. He's been doing this all day, all night. Hasn't hurt them. <coughs> but yes, I got one fella coming in here. Let another fella coming from Kampha Helix. Uh, you guys will see him. But yes, this guy needs to recover, so I need him to stay by himself for the meantime. But he's he was just looking fabulous. Um, earlier I put the mirror in here, fed him a little bit. He ate one pellet, one pellet only. It's just a very small pellet. Overall, he's doing really good. 
Yeah, let me know what you guys think. This is my setup right here. And I freaking love this. Never, I never thought I would do this, but this is something else. I like this. In a very small space like this, maybe like a regular bedroom size, you know? And if you guys haven't seen my Instagram video, I fed these go fish off of my hands. Pretty cool. All right, that's gonna be it for the video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys.